In this problem, we're asked to find the electric field, the charge, and the induced charge on this parallel capacitor right here. It's filled with this dielectric of 5.4, and we know the area on the plates over here is going to be 810 centimeters squared. Um, if we convert this to meters, it's actually going to be 810 times 10 to the uh, negative 4. That's basically going to be uh, centimeters squared is equal to uh, uh, is equal to uh, ten to the negative two squared. All right, so we're going to end up with uh, uh, zero point zero eight one meters for the area. But anyway, um, let's go ahead and figure out what the electric field is. We can use the K equals uh, C equals K epsilon naught A over D. Let's just remember that for parallel plates, we also have V equals EX. That's going to be the voltage equals uh, electric field over distance. So essentially, we're trying to solve for this distance. Um, let's let's just swap it. So we'll put um, uh, X is equal to KE naught A over C. Now we can try to solve for that real quick. So we're going to say that um, 5.4 times 8.85 negative 12 times 0 0.081 divide that by c which is 560e to the negative 12 and that's going to give us the distance and we can use that um, dividing 94 by the distance so the extra field is 13598.59 volts per meter. For the charge, we can use the equation C equals Q over V, and so we can just multiply V times C, and we'll just get the charge. So it's going to be 94 times 560 E to the negative 12. And so uh, we get the charge of 5.26 E to the negative 8 coulombs. And then for the final thing, the induced charge, we have this Q. And then for the final thing, the induced charge, we have this interesting little equation. The induced charge is equal to Q times 1 minus 1 over K. And we can use that. So we'll just say that uh, the charge times um, 1 minus 1 over 5.4. And uh, we get the induced charge is 4.3 even negative 8 coulombs.